Hey, good morning, everyone. It is James in Kobe. It's night. Well, almost day. It's actually day. It's uh, 5.30 a.m. By the time I post this, it'll be after 6. Anyway, um, it's dark. As, as dark as my shirt. It's, it's 19, 20 degrees Celsius. I can't believe it. Yesterday it was 27 degrees Celsius. It was incredibly nice and hot. I went out for a nice run in the morning and I played um, JRA, horse racing. That's online horse racing in this case. I didn't win anything this time, but I, the day before I won 4,600 yen, which is okay. Anyway, today is Lotto 6 and I posted my Lotto 6 prediction to my paying members group. So in order for you to see my prediction, you need to be a member of this group. Okay, just go to my main page and there you'll see a join button if you're using a PC or Android device. Okay, iPhone users won't see it. And you can take that up with Google because um, uh, I'm not in charge of that. Okay, um, let's win big. And there's some strange stories that I just read from Japan today. That is a news source. The first one is about a young lady's apartment. Well, she left it unlocked. She was careless. She wasn't home, but the, the strange thing he did was he washed her lingerie. Her, so she, he washed the lingerie and then he hung them. When she came home, she discovered her lingerie had been washed by someone. So she went to the nearby police box and reported it. And uh, sure enough, the police caught the guy because uh, there was another incident in the same building. And I think the guy lives in the same building. Call it a case of cleanliness fetish. Okay, I can't wrap my mind around that. Weird. Uh, the next case happened in Shizuoka. Um, a girl in her early 20s plunged to her death from a bridge from using her smartphone. The dangers of using a smartphone while walking. Okay, you gotta, you have to see your surroundings. I have to admit, I have used my phone while walking for directions or just to check a quick email, but I don't regularly use it out in the open when I'm walking. I like to just see my surroundings. And uh, in fact, I don't even listen to music. I don't have any earbuds in my ears. So that is a serious warning, guys. You have to be careful of your surroundings when you're using your smartphone. Nowadays, I see mindless zombies everywhere, young and old, just walking and staring. And when I move to the site, they move in parallel with me. So I move to the other side and they do the same thing. That irritates me because they're not even looking at me. They're just getting the feeling. So guys, do your best not to do that. Otherwise you'll plunge to your death. So you can read the article on Japan today. So let me recall the story. Uh, it was a long weekend last week because of Bunka no Hi on Friday. There was a father and a friend and the girl in her 20s. They went somewhere. They were on their way home. And then the father stopped near a bridge, a narrow bridge. And then she got out and uh, wanted to take some photos of some wild deer. So she had her phone out like this. And uh, she was walking alongside this narrow bridge with a with a very low guard rail. So it had to be up to her, maybe her knees or just slightly above it. And then she tumbled over and down the ravine like 40 meters. <laughs> and by the time the paramedics came, she was pronounced dead. So let that be a warning to all of us, poor girl. Anyway, that is it for now. I'm going to continue walking my puppy. I'm glad there's no one around, but it's warm. And I'm hot, a little bit hot. Okay, guys, let's win big. Yeah.